The Gerald R. Ford class aircraft carrier is the newest generation of supercarriers built for the United States Navy, designed to replace the older Nimitz class carriers and continue America's global maritime dominance. The idea for a new class began in the 1990s, when the U.S. Navy wanted a carrier that could operate more efficiently, launch aircraft faster, and cost less to maintain over decades of service. Development officially started in the early 2000s, and the project was named after the 38th President of the United States, Gerald R. Ford, who had also served in the Navy during World War II. Construction of the first ship, the USS Gerald R. Ford CVN 78 began in 2005 at the Newport News Shipbuilding Yard in Virginia, the only shipyard in the United States capable of building nuclear powered aircraft carriers. It took years of design, assembly, testing, and integration of new systems before the ship was finally launched in 2013 and commissioned into active service in July 2017. The carrier represents a massive leap in naval engineering. It is over 1,090 feet long. Weighs about 100,000 tons, and is powered by two advanced A 1B nuclear reactors that provide enough energy to run the ship for more than two decades without refueling. It can carry and operate more than 75 aircraft, including F A 18 Super Hornets, electronic warfare planes, and future carrier based stealth jets. One of the biggest innovations is the electromagnetic aircraft launch system, known as EMALS, which replaces the older steam catapult system. This new launcher allows aircraft to take off more smoothly, with less stress on the planes, and it can launch aircraft more quickly. The Ford class also uses advanced arresting gear for landing, improved radar systems, new elevators for weapons handling, and better automation to reduce crew size. Compared with earlier carriers, the Ford class produces more electricity, has higher sortie rates, and is designed for faster aircraft operations, meaning it can launch and recover more aircraft per day during combat. It is also built with better survivability, more efficient maintenance systems, and the ability to adapt to future technologies such as unmanned drones. After years of testing and trials, the USS Gerald R. Ford completed its first major deployment in 2023, showing the world what the new generation of carriers could do. Additional ships of the same class are under construction, including the USS John F. Kennedy CVN 79, USS Enterprise CVN 80, and USS Doris Miller CVN 81. The Gerald R. Ford class stands today as the largest and most advanced warship ever built, a symbol of American technological power and global naval presence. It is more than just a ship, it's a mobile city, an airbase at sea, and a declaration that the United States continues to lead in modern naval warfare.